Hello everyone, my name is Nomus and welcome back to another episode of Project Zomboid. Picking up here May 23rd, 2pm, up in our bedroom, and uh, we're going to start this episode off by doing some tailoring. I've got our to-do journal open here in the bottom left corner, and today I want to start things off by making a fanny pack, a bathrobe, and a bandana with some of the uh, items we've got in our uh, tailoring bag here. So, let's open up our crafting menu here see exactly what we need for all these items uh, so to make a bathrobe we just need a uh, bath towel with three units okay so let's uh, go ahead and make one of those this should also give us some XP into our tailoring we're going to try and start the next few episodes off by doing some new recipes so we're at 34.58 let's go ahead and craft ourselves a bathrobe for uh our time around home when we're not out looting and killing zombies and getting in trouble takes uh, 800 uh, time not too bad we are getting tired we are hungry so we might have to uh, look at uh, getting some food here for ourselves. there we go up to 37 let's make ourselves a uh, fanny pack using some denim strips a belt and some thread And might have to tweak that uh, that bathrobe recipe. So I think Slender was attempting to use three bath towels, not just three three units of a bath towel. Both of these recipes are from uh, Slender's Lone Wanderers mod. And there we go, we got ourselves a fanny pack. So we're gonna go ahead and wear that on the front. And it's got three unit capacity. We do have a fanny pack mod, which should give this some better weight reduction too. Yeah, weight reduction of 80. So there we go. I think we'll be keeping our smokes in there and our beta blockers. Perfect. We could probably even throw in our, our pen. Maybe our bobby pins. Our pen. Can we still write on our map? If that's put away? Yes, we can. Okay. So let's close that. Uh, scissors, needles. Okay. Uh, bandana I wanted to make as well. Alright, let's unfavorite the bathrobe. Where was the bandana? Let's go over to tailoring. Bandana. Okay, so. Three sheets, some thread. Let's craft that. We're up to 39, almost 40 XP there. Up to 42, so about three XP for each recipe item here. Uh, we could also make a Bruce Lee styled bandana. Colored face bandana. Uh, one cool thing about crafting these clothing is it's gonna be a random color each time you craft it. So we got ourselves a purple head bandana. We got our black bathrobe. Let's go ahead and put this towel back in here. You know what? I might try and get a different color head bandana. Let's try this again. Uh, let's do the face bandana. Preferably, I'd like a black one, I think. Pink. Let's try again here. We got enough for one more attempt. What do we get? Looks like a purple one. Oh, well. We'll wear the purple one, I guess. And we'll put our bathrobe away. Does this have a size? Oh yeah, what size did we end up making? Is that one we can actually wear? Small. <laughs> Not so much. Well, we're gonna throw that in here anyway. So there we go, we did some tailoring. And we got ourselves 
up to 47, so a ways to go to level 3, but at least we're able to get some XP in some different ways. Now, what else can we put inside our fanny pack? Our lighter, maybe our spoon, put our needle away. We'll put our thread back into our bag here. Put our nails in there. That's about it. I think I got some more smokes here we can put in there. And I think that lighter's almost done, so let's throw another backup one in there. Cool. Any other pills we want to put in there? Maybe alcohol wipes. And a bandage. And let's put a red pen in there. And our journal. And our rubber duck. All right. Yeah, it's got the same weight reduction as our big hiking bag, so we're not really changing the weight distribution at all there. But some of our odds and ends are in our fanny pack now. So we need to go get some food. I've moved all of our food downstairs. I got one other thing I want to do here is making a throwable bottle. So we will do that. This is another mod. I do have some empty bottles here. I think you need to use the glass ones. So let's quickly do that and we're going to get some food. So here we go. Make throwable bottle. So let's craft one. You can also use a jar. All right, equip trap and perform basic attack to throw. So it must be similar to like a Molotov or a smoke bomb. Uh, we will give this a try at some point today. Can I attach that? Oh, I can attach it to my holster. Interesting. All right, food. What can we have today? You know what? Let's continue eating some of these oats. So we do want to start gaining some weight. And that'll help. I do have some dog food too. You know what? I might have one of these. And pop out antidepressant. Not quite as much fat, but... Let's just eat this whole thing. Maybe that'll help us start gaining some weight. Nope, not quite. Just made us very unhappy. Alright, tin. Uh, I think I'll put those over here now. Starting to organize our kitchen a little bit. Uh, pretty much the same setup as our last. Oh, actually, I guess I'm putting tins over there. Same as our last uh, playthrough out at the farm, since it's the exact same house, pretty much. Okay, let's get this out. Have our antidepressant. And I'm going to keep... Oh, actually I don't have them in there. I'm going to keep some antidepressants inside our fanny pack as well. Where did I keep all the antidepressants? Are they in here? Alright, let's take those. Put that in there. And you know what? I'm gonna put our food in there too. Almost out of water. Still got a little bit left in here. Actually, quite a bit. 90. Our health is starting to drop. And that's due to our unhappiness level being so high. It's 550. We're tired. 
or weep you were bored. Since we're already tired, I think we're just going to read. Um, let's see. Let's check our skills here. Uh, we were, yeah, we're going to try and hotwire our car, so we should probably read this mechanic book. Continue that. So let's grab that. Have a seat here. And we'll read this for the remainder of the evening. Our unhappiness level is actually not going down. Thought it would have because we're we had the antidepressant. Oh no, it is going down, just not when you're fast forwarding. Okay. Time for a smoke. How much of this book do we get read? Up to 140. We don't even have all the tools for the car to be taking stuff apart. So I guess we need to find that stuff first. All right, nine o'clock, you know what? I think we're just gonna go to bed here. Uh, we've made pretty good progress on the book. We have got a decent boost there of 2.1 multiplier. All right, let's just go to sleep. Here we go. Unhappiness level is completely taken care of. Keep this stuff clean in our inventory. Still got a fairly, fairly high amount of things we're holding on to here. I guess it's because our secondary bag isn't equipped. Okay. Off we go. We're a bit bored. But that's fine. You guys are staying here today. Eventually I will take you with me. When we go fight those uh, bandits nearby. Ideally, I'd like to keep them alive. So we can uh, move out to a farm sometime and actually have them uh, walking around. I'm just a little hesitant to have them walking around outside right now. So I feel like... Uh, they might end up getting themselves killed. I'd rather have them around to help us with bandit uh, raids than to worry about actually clearing out zombies. Okay, so uh, today I guess we're going to go... We got our gas in the last episode, so I think we're going to go check out these homes up here. And then, yeah, continue to leave me your comments uh, below for where you think we should take the car to. We got a full tank of gas, plus those extra four gas cans. Let's just leave that one. I've checked out those houses. Let's actually just run up to the next group. So we're keeping our eye out for car tools, definitely. Wow, more naked zombies. Let's just go around the back. Oh, 
there's one in there. Check this side. Actually, you know what? I should check for an alarm. Windows are broken, so there shouldn't be one. Containers here, some more beta blockers, more rubber decks. Gun case with a gun inside. Mm, FN scar. Needs a magazine. Let's take that though. Ball duffel bag. It's empty. Another piano. Ah, both empty. Keep grabbing these belts. Another pair of jeans. Are they are size. No. They are clean, so let's just rip those up. We'll take the denim strips. That's uh, nothing in there. Okay. A little bit of food. Oh, some peas. Okay. Shotgun shells, our garbage bag, plastic bag, we'll take that for crafting. And that's it for this house except for the garage. Well, let's go back out the uh, window here, or the door. It's where we found the pastor. And where we found uh, the veteran. Coming from this house, actually. Ooh, and it's open. Oh, welding rods. There's a trolley. Might want to try that out. That's one of the more recent mods I've enabled. Oh, there's our propane torch. Some more ropes, more SIGs. All right, let's try this. Um, equip both hands. No, that's not what I want. Hold on here. Drop. Okay, look at this. So, what do we, how do we, how do we do this? Take trolley. Well, that's holding it. You're supposed to be able to push this around and use it as a container. Yeah, there's the container. Hold 75. How do we use it though? Hmm. Not sure. Equip in both hands. Well, if anyone's used this mod, the trolley mod, I might have to let me know how to use that. Because that might be useful for us. Well, we found one of the, uh, the main items we were looking for, that propane torch. So we can can up our soup now. Uh, there's not going to be anything else there for us to check out. 
So you know what? Let's go around the back side of this. We'll continue up to the next homes. Let's go through a jaunt. Oh, did I tear anything? Nope, I think we're fine. Bit of a trip there. I don't think we've seen any boats either, have we yet? I was hoping some of these homes by the river would have a boat. Uh, maybe we can keep checking for alarms even though the windows are broken. I'm a little paranoid. Alright, one right there. Got another radio here. Chance for us to find that broadcast frequency. Okay, apparently potential carpenter's house. How's this hammer? Oh, I might take that as a backup. All right, no frequency there. Trapping intermediate, we have that. We'll grab the newspaper though. I think that's upstairs. that we really need to find a saw now saw and car tools eventually one of these closets is going to be pay dirt sheet with us. You know what? Let's fill up our water. Oh god. Oh god. Someone just opened the door too. Oh. That's a lot of doors opening. Bandit, do you think? Survivor? Oh. It's just a survivor. Oh, that scared me. Donald, what are you doing here, man? Donald. All right, Donald's joined the group. Oh, started, to, started to panic there a bit. All right, Donald, what are you? Short blade, long blade, long blunt. Got the baseball bat. Okay, well, sticking with me today. Let's go, bud. More and more survivors. Oh, there's a uh, a camp up there with some traps. This is the first um, random camping spawn. I've come across. That's super cool. We're definitely going to take those tents and those traps. That is super cool. I wonder if this was uh, Donald's. Can I pick these up? Yeah. Yeah. Nice. All right, so uh, we do have the tents are containers mod, but um, I guess it has to be a tent that we put down. So we'll take one of these. 
Take those both with us. That's a good find. Nothing in there. Yeah, very cool. Alright, let's continue checking houses here, Don. I like that. Yeah, I was really hoping like something like this would have a, a boat parked. Oops, we got a cop here. Denim shirts. Holster, another uh, police jacket, a little torn up. All right, pepper, we got so much pepper at home. Way more than we need. Uh, some chicken that's not rotten yet, let's take that. Oh, is the power off now? I didn't see the... Um, wasn't blue. Yeah, power's off now. Okay, so we gotta do a lot of cooking when we get home. And it's good that we got the propane torch. We can make a bunch of soup out of all of our ingredients that we have. I might actually go back and grab that campfire kit too. A woolly hat. Let's take that. So how long do we make it with power? Good thing we got the gas yesterday, hey? 15 days. So half of the potential time. Ah, still nothing in those. Um, food. We never did eat that can of oats. Let's go and eat that. And have a smoke as well. Let's try and avoid this group. <laughs> Don't panic, Donald. If you stay with me. You might live. Oh, God. No, oh, Donald. <laughs> Donald. Okay, maybe I should just take Donald home. I just don't know anymore. He's, he's panicking. He got scratched. I know how bad it is though. Well, we'll see. We got a couple more houses up here. There's also some crates. Out in one of the fields, we can take a look at straight through there. Now, there's quite a few zombies around this house. Maybe we avoid that. Come this way, Don. Yeah, those crates there. Let's take a look at these quickly. Shovel. Some paint. Okay. Is there more over here? Or is that the only one? No, there is more, yeah. Alright, come on, man. Off we go. In search of tools. Oh shit. Donald, run. Oh my god. <laughs> Three of them. They've just got um, melee weapons. You know what? I got a pistol. And I have plus two aiming. 
<laughs> Maybe I could take these guys on. I don't know. They're sneaking off. Maybe we let them go. I thought like I had a rifle for a second. They probably looted all this stuff. Anything worth taking? Yeah. Where are they going to? Didn't even bother going in there. A quick check for alarm. Did they go in here? Suspension. Like, maybe they have a farm out there? Oh, wait, they're coming back. They're coming back. Maybe we can surprise them. Let's try. Back off a bit here. Freeze, freeze, freeze. Okay, what do we do now? Nope. Alright, two down. Liam and Donald are fighting it out. I don't think we can actually do anything with these guys. I think we just take them out. All right, we're, we're bleeding. We scratched. All right, let's disinfect. All right, Donald, you did good. That's our first bandit encounter. Yeah, I don't think we could do anything with those guys. Oh shit, now all the zombies are gonna come. Oh crap, did he get bit? No, I think he's fine. Alright, take care of him, please. Right, we gotta get home. We're, uh, pretty hurt. Ooh, an army coat. Damn. Let's take this whole outfit. That army coat is interesting. I don't think I've ever seen that. And another garden hoe. Okay. Yeah, let's get out of here. Before the whole neighborhood comes. Got our first kills. And our aiming reloading. Our first XP into aiming reloading. Alright, man. Come on. Let's go. Well, let's run. We gotta get healed up here. Luckily, they didn't have any guns, and uh, we just got a scratch. Okay, I think we're good. I think we're going to be good. I'm going to cut back uh, once we're home, and uh, we're going to take a look at uh, this army coat that we picked up. All right, we're back home in one piece. Look at our little group of survivors now. Got a small army. Okay, uh, first thing... I need to make some more soup, hey? I need to use up these, uh, these ingredients before they go bad. So I think we're going to cook as much as we can here. Um, I should go get a generator. Bring it here. That we, could, we could still have power. But let's, um... Let's cook up some stuff here. What can we do? What can we do? Let's go to our crafting menu here. So, favorites. Nothing available there. So we can just do 
soup. Um, if we wanted to do more TV dinners, um, we would need more meat or dog food. We do have dog food. Okay, so let's open that. All right, let's make another meal here. Um, make TV dinner out of our eggplant. Because those will never go bad on us. Okay. Good. So that's all the uh, meat that we've got right now. We don't have any other small rodent meat. Okay, so then I guess soup it is. All right, so soup. Let's make some soup from random pasta. All right, so from our leek. I don't think we can use mutton chop for anything, so we can probably put some in there. Soup, uh, chicken, let's do our peas. Actually, we may have been able to can peas. Probably should have checked that first. Prepare peas for canning. Yeah. We can, actually. Make two can. Okay. Uh, vinegar, sugar, tin cans. How many tin cans do we have? Seven. All right, let's, uh, let's do canned peas. Okay, cool. Uh, let's get our cooked soup here. Let's can that. So, this one here, right? Uh, we can add some salt and pepper. Sure. We can still put them into cans. Okay, good. So let's add some salt. Let's pour the soup into cans. Nice. Uh, then we've got to cook this stuff still. All right, let's continue making this one. So let's add in some more peas. And we'll add in, I kind of want to keep this bread and cheese for other stuff. We'll do our pepper and salt. Oh, I did open canned peas. Damn it. <laughs> That's the one that we just made. Um, I don't know if we can use chicken for anything. Fried chicken, bread slices. Oh, if we had a frying pan and baking tray and a rolling pin, oh, we need a few things. Is there any way to make a baking pan? No. A frying pan? I don't think I have those things, surprisingly enough. No, I don't. Okay, you know what? I think let's go with this. Um, let's put this stuff away for now. Let's go get a generator and bring it over. So we can just have our fridge again. Drop that. It's going to drop all this stuff off. That stuff it should still last uh, enough time for us to go get something. Um, some water. 
All right, what else we got to drop off here? We're so tired. I think we can do this before it gets dark out, though. Let's drop our tent kit and our traps. Okay. You know what? Let's just drop this whole bag. We're gonna run down and get a uh, generator. Hopefully we don't die. Okay, so we know there are three around us. Right? And we know there are bandits down here. There's one up there. And there's one out in the field. Maybe we try and get the one straight up. Might be the best bet. Oh, we are quite exhausted here. Let's try and rest for a moment. Let's get back some of our endurance. Get this generator, get electricity again. Well, that's going to cause more noise. Attract more zombies to us, too. Close that. Yeah, now things will get, get interesting. I wonder if the uh, generator would attract bandits to us as well. I don't know how that mechanic exactly would work. I could hop the fence, but I am so tired I might not make it. Alright, let's just uh, crouch and walk. Oh, we got uh, a few zombies there. All right, so where was it about? Straight down. Over there? Or was it over here? Is there a shed over there? Did I mark it wrong? Don't remember where it is. What the, what the heck? So that's our road. That's that road. It's that one right there. Okay, so it is over here. Must be a shed over here. Oh, that house up there, okay. Gotcha. I guess this is why we should have grabbed the uh, generator a while ago. So I don't have to rush over there when I'm exhausted. I was like, where is it? All right, uh, take generator. All right, let's go. Try and get back. Yeah, I'm gonna be exhausted here pretty soon. Go through this way. Just cut straight down. Don't run into a big group. Not gonna be all the run soon. <laughs> I 
<laughs> I don't know what's up with all these naked zombies. I don't get it. Um, we're going to attract this guy's attention. Right when I run out of energy, too. Alright. Let's slowly inch our way towards home. Get around the corner so we lose him. Should be good now. We got ourselves a Jenny. We got some gas for this. Oh, um, where do we set it up, though? I don't want to set it up right in the corner there, because then they'll be right near the door, breaking in. I could set it up back here. Crap. It's a generator near us. Or, uh, not generator, a zombie near us. Knocking on the door. Oh, I should, probably should have tried to stealth kill them. Come on, uppercut. Any time now. <laughs> there we go. Good lord. Alright, let's grab a gas can. one. We still have those other gas cans in the car that I haven't brought back. Alright, let's connect that. Luckily we had found the generator magazine already. Okay, let's turn that on. And we see how much attention this brings over to us. All right. So our food should be good for a little while again. Um, let's take our soup cans and get our propane torch and welding rods. Okay, we'll seal these. Uh, hold on, where's our recipes? Why doesn't it let us do that? Let's pull those out. And let's go over to our metalworking. Seal. Soup cans. Oh, we still need a swap machine. Oh, we still need a metal welder's mask. And we need the saw. Damn it, so we can't do it yet. Still need that saw. Okay, so we definitely need the uh, fridge running. Damn it. Okay. We'll hold on to this stuff then. So close. Uh, I guess I'm going to leave all that stuff in there. What are we going to eat? I could have this pie slice. Oh, rotten oranges. Rotten cherry. Melted ice cream. Damn it. Okay, let's eat that. Change our bandage to. Ah, we're gaining weight. Nice. Okay, let's change our bandage here. Oh, and we gotta take a look at that army jacket. 
And you know what? I'm going to turn off lights here to conserve fuel. Let's only have the ones we need on. That's burnt out. That's fine. You know what? Let's use our mechanical flashlight here. Let's go turn off these lights upstairs too. Don't need to use unnecessary amounts of fuel. Just use our flashlight as much as we can when we're home. Okay, good. Okay, let's go take a look at this army jacket. So, where did that go? In here, army coat. So 20, oh, it's tight. <laughs> what's, the, what's the size here? It's maybe too small for us. Extra small, okay, well, anyway, let's just take a look at this. So is this the same as our current jacket? 2040. That's the same, right? Yeah, 2040. It's actually um, a better run speed modifier and no combat modifier. So it's actually a bit better than our current uh, jacket, but it is a bit small. So we would have a chance of tearing this. If we wore it. Um, that's pretty small though. Extra small. We're going to keep it. If we ever get super lightweight. We'll uh, try using that. Our scratch is healed though. Alright. So we got some traps. We got ourselves a tent. Uh, we got our new. Or another gun. Does not have a. Uh. Uh, magazine in it, so we'd still have to find a, you know, get to that gun store. Or to a police station. The gun store, though, obviously had some uh, hostels in there. Uh, we are closer to being able to can up our soup. We just need to find that saw. Um, hopefully we find that soon. So saw and card tools. I think that'll do it for the, this episode today, guys. Um, let me know what you thought down below. Our first encounter this season with uh, bandits. And uh, we came out on top. So far, we've done pretty good with the uh, hostile NPCs. Um, yeah, subscribe if you're new. Hit that like button. And until next time, I'll talk to you all later.